Good afternoon, everyone. I spoke to the president a little while back, and he sounded great. As the American people learned just a little while ago, President Trump is going home tonight. So we're headed to Utah for the vice presidential debate. Karen and I just wanted to express our profound gratitude first to the incredible medical staff at Walter Reed Hospital and at the White House for the care, the concern that they've shown for this president and our first family and all of those impacted the White House staff. And let me also take this opportunity to say how grateful we are for the expressions of concern and support and the prayers of millions of Americans who've uh, remembered our president, remembered our wonderful First Lady. We really believe it is emblematic of the love and the care and the compassion the American people have shown all of those uh, that have been impacted by the coronavirus from the very beginning of this pandemic. But as I said, uh, when, uh, when the President told me that he was headed back to the White House. He told me to head to Utah. And we're looking very much forward to the vice presidential debate. The stakes in this election have never been higher. The choice has never been clearer. And I look forward to the opportunity to take our case to the American people for four more years for President Donald Trump in the White House. So thank you all very much. Mr. Vice President.